Mane Livestock Farming PVT Limited is a meat processing business in Aurangabad, Maharashtra. It was established in 2016 by Laxman Mane. The company rears chickens and processes their meat into a variety of products, including chicken nuggets, chicken sausages, chicken burgers, and chicken kebabs. Mane Livestock Farming also sells eggs and poultry feed. The company has a state-of-the-art meat processing plant that meets all the required hygiene and safety standards. The plant is equipped with modern machinery that ensures that the meat is processed efficiently and safely. Mane Livestock Farming also has a team of experienced and qualified staff who are committed to providing high-quality products to its customers. The company has been growing rapidly in recent years and is now one of the leading meat processing businesses in Aurangabad. It supplies its products to supermarkets, restaurants, and other food retailers in the city. Mane Livestock Farming is also exporting its products to other parts of India and the world. Here are some of the key features of Mane Livestock Farming's meat processing business. State-of-the-art meat processing plant that meets all the required hygiene and safety standards. Modern machinery that ensures that the meat is processed efficiently and safely. Experienced and qualified staff who are committed to providing high-quality products. Rapidly growing business that is now one of the leading meat processing businesses in Aurangabad. Supplies its products to supermarkets, restaurants, and other food retailers in the city. Exports its products to other parts of India and the world. If you are looking for a reliable and trustworthy meat processing business in Aurangabad, Mane Livestock Farming is a great option. The company has a proven track record of providing high-quality products and services. Sure, here is an image of a poultry chicken processing plant. Image of poultry chicken processing plant. A poultry chicken processing plant is a facility where chickens are slaughtered and processed for their meat. The plant is typically divided into several areas, including, the receiving area. This is where the chickens are unloaded from trucks and weighed. Image of poultry chicken processing plant receiving area. The stunning area. This is where the chickens are stunned to render them unconscious before slaughter. Image of poultry chicken processing plant stunning area. The slaughtering area. This is where the chickens are killed and their blood is drained. Image of poultry chicken processing plant slaughtering area. The defeathering area. This is where the chicken's feathers are removed. Image of poultry chicken processing plant defeathering area. The evisceration area. This is where the chicken's internal organs are removed. Image of poultry chicken processing plant evisceration area. The chilling area. This is where the chickens are chilled to prevent bacteria growth. Image of poultry chicken processing plant chilling area. The packaging area. This is where the chickens are packaged for distribution. Image of poultry chicken processing plant packaging area. The processing of chickens in a poultry plant is a highly regulated process in order to ensure the safety of the meat. The plant must be kept clean and sanitary, and the workers must be properly trained. The chickens must also be slaughtered in a humane manner. Poultry chicken processing plants play an important role in the food industry. They provide a safe and efficient way to process chickens for their meat. This meat is then used in a variety of food products, such as chicken nuggets, chicken sandwiches, and chicken soup. Goat proceedings business is a broad term that can refer to a variety of businesses that involve goats. Some common types of goat proceedings businesses include, goat farming. This is the business of raising goats for their meat, milk, or fiber. Goat farmers typically own a herd of goats and provide them with food, water, shelter, and veterinary care. They also market and sell the goats products. Image of goat farming business. Goat meat processing. This is the business of slaughtering and processing goats for their meat. Goat meat processors typically have a facility that is equipped with the necessary machinery and equipment to slaughter, butcher, and package goat meat. They also market and sell the goat meat. Image of goat meat processing business. Goat milk processing. This is the business of processing goat milk into a variety of products, such as cheese, yogurt, and butter. 
Goat milk processes typically have a facility that is equipped with the necessary machinery and equipment to pasteurize, homogenize, and package goat milk. They also market and sell the goat milk products. Image of goat milk processing business. Goat fiber processing. This is the business of processing goat hair and wool into a variety of products, such as yarn, fabric, and rugs. Goat fiber processors typically have a facility that is equipped with the necessary machinery and equipment to clean, card, spin, and dye goat fiber. They also market and sell the goat fiber products. Image of goat fiber processing business. The profitability of a goat proceedings business depends on a number of factors, such as the type of business, the size of the operation, the cost of inputs, and the market demand for goat products. However, goat proceedings businesses can be a viable and profitable business opportunity for those who are willing to put in the hard work and dedication. Here are some tips for starting a successful goat proceedings business. Do your research. Before you start any business, it is important to do your research and understand the industry. This includes understanding the different types of goat proceedings businesses, the cost of inputs, the market demand for goat products, and the regulatory requirements. Develop a business plan. A business plan is a roadmap for your business. It should outline your goals, strategies, and financial projections. Get the necessary permits and licenses. Depending on the type of goat proceedings business you are starting, you may need to obtain permits and licenses from the local government. Build a strong team. No one can succeed in business alone. You will need to build a strong team of employees who are passionate about goats and the goat industry. Market your products. Once you have your products, you need to market them to potential customers. This can be done through a variety of channels, such as advertising, public relations, and social media. Provide excellent customer service. Goat proceedings businesses are all about customer service. Make sure you provide your customers with excellent service so that they will come back for more. If you follow these tips, you will be well on your way to starting a successful goat proceedings business. A fish processing business is a business that processes fish into a variety of products, such as fillets, canned fish, and fish sticks. Fish processing businesses typically have a facility that is equipped with the necessary machinery and equipment to clean, fillet, cook, and package fish. They also market and sell the fish products. The profitability of a fish processing business depends on a number of factors, such as the type of business, the size of the operation, the cost of inputs, and the market demand for fish products. However, fish processing businesses can be a viable and profitable business opportunity for those who are willing to put in the hard work and dedication. Here are some tips for starting a successful fish processing business. Do your research. Before you start any business, it is important to do your research and understand the industry. This includes understanding the different types of fish processing businesses, the cost of inputs, the market demand for fish products, and the regulatory requirements. Develop a business plan. A business plan is a roadmap for your business. It should outline your goals, strategies, and financial projections. Get the necessary permits and licenses. Depending on the type of fish processing business you are starting, you may need to obtain permits and licenses from the local government. Build a strong team. No one can succeed in business alone. You will need to build a strong team of employees who are passionate about fish and the fish processing industry. Market your products. Once you have your products, you need to market them to potential customers. This can be done through a variety of channels, such as advertising, public relations, and social media. Provide excellent customer service. Fish processing businesses are all about customer service. Make sure you provide your customers with excellent service so that they will come back for more. If you follow these tips, you will be well on your way to starting a successful fish processing business. Here are some additional things to consider when starting a fish processing business. The location of your facility is important. You will need to be located near a source of fresh fish, as well as a market for your products. You will need to have access to the necessary machinery and equipment. This includes equipment for cleaning, filleting, cooking, and packaging fish. You will need to have a team of qualified employees. These employees should have experience in fish processing and be able to work safely and efficiently.
you will need to comply with all applicable regulations. This includes regulations related to food safety, health, and the environment. You will need to market your products effectively. This includes creating a strong brand and reaching out to potential customers through a variety of channels. If you are considering starting a fish processing business, I recommend doing your research and creating a business plan. This will help you to identify the challenges and opportunities in the industry and develop.